Hello guys, my name is Nora Saha and today in this tutorial we are going to make a small project using a string. So first go ahead and create a python file then save it In this project we want to get name and marks of a student and so the results sheet using those name and marks. Now to make this problem a lot easier, let's divide it into multiple part. For that I want to use python comment. Sometime while writing a code we use comment to describe our code. So that whenever we revisit the code or someone see our code, they will understand what the code is about. In Python, we write a code using hashtag. So if I write hash PRI and print and and if I save this and run it then python will only print this is comment but python will not execute this line of code because we mark this code as a comment as i said earlier our first step is to break down our project into multiple part so our first part is about getting name and mark of two student so i write getting name and second part is about creating a result using above data in last part we just print our result now let's see how we can get data from the user to get data from the user we use input function if I write input This is our text but to use this data we have to store it on a variable if i copy this and make a variable easy then assign that value enter some text Saha. okay if you understand up to here then let's write a code for our first part. our first part is finished in python if we want to join two string we use plus operator and the process of joining two string called string concatenation for example let's write 
first name Navraj last name Saha here you can see it joined to a string one thing you have to note that this plus operator is only used in between same data type like here both are a string or we can add two number like a plus operator we can also use multiply operator if we want to repeat something for a certain number of time for example it print minus sign five time okay now let's use this to concept for that first i'm gonna comment this four line of code then create a variable called result string save it and run okay i forget to print that save it again and run here it print now i want to print this text underneath of this dash dash line so i just add backslash n just before the text this uh, backslash n means new line that means everything after the backslash will start from the new line save this and run it again here you go now let's make a structure for our result sheet save it and run so far so good as like backslash n we also have backslash t for the alternate of tab key so i'm gonna put that in between name and mark save this now it looks perfect structure for marking sheet. Now I also want to replace this name and mark with this name variable and mark variable. So for that, if I have f name equal to Nora's name equal to Saha and I want to join these two data then either I can use plus operator or I can use Python format function just to have to write parenthesis it print noras ha because python replaced this parenthesis with the value of yf name and this parenthesis with the value of yell name 
okay now let's use this concept also replace name and mark with a parenthesis At last, print the result sheet. Also, remove this comment. Save this and run. First student name. mark second student name and here it is we have just completed our string project now to recap this tutorial we learn how to get data from user then use those data to make a result sheet so this is the end of this tutorial i hope you learned something from this tutorial and i will see you on the next tutorial